welcome back to Sydney and Starlet. And if you're new here, wake up! Welcome, enjoy the Yummy Dolls videos. So today, me and Sydney are going to be reading Baby Einstein. Baby Einstein, Great Minds Start Little, Playful Discoveries. My first book of letters. So let's get started. Wow, can you say book? Book. Book. A is for Bubble. apple. 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 This man is selling apples in the city. What color are they? Do you like to eat apples? What sounds do they make when you bite into them? They make the sound of crunch. Can you say crunch? What? Crunch. They make this crunchy apple sound. And what color are the apples? What color? Bubble. What color? Red. Red. There you go. B is for fat. Box. Box. There you go. What shape is this box? What color is it? It's like a square or a rectangle, and it's like a brownish, orangish, yellow color. C is for four. Not four. Well, what does this say? Four. Cap. 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 There you go. A cap is a type of hat. Can you say hat? Hat. Hat. What color is the man's cap? What color? Blue. Yolk. Ooh. D is for? Doll. 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 The girl is holding a doll in her arms. What is the girl wearing that also begins with the letter D? I think she's wearing a dress. Can you say dress? What? Dress. E is for eyes. What color are the girl's eyes? What color are your eyes? Well, me and Sydney's eyes are blue, but her eyes are brown. Can you say brown? Love. Brown. F is for fruit. 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 How many pieces of fruit are on the plates? Can you name them all? Do you have a favorite fruit? This, these look like apples. That might be an apple, that might be a mango, I'm not sure. And then this, this one is bananas. How many fruits are there? One, two, three, four, five. Good job, five fruits. Do you have a favorite fruit? Hmm. Well, actually, I've heard that avocados are considered a fruit. It's kind of surprising. It's kind of surprising. I would think it would be considered a vegetable, but it's a fruit. So I would say my favorite fruit is an avocado. <laughs> What's your favorite fruit? You just want to go to the next page. Okay, Sydney. <laughs> G is for girl. Girl. The girl in this painting is skating on the ice with her friend. What do you think her name is? What color is her dress? I think her name is Rosetta. Can I say Rosetta? Rosetta. Rosetta. And what color is her dress? Red. 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 H is for? Hat. 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 Point to the girl's hat. Do you like to wear hats? What else in this picture begins with the letter H? Well, I see hands. Let's start with the letter H. Can you see hands? Hands. Hands. Hands! And they also see head. Can you see a head? Hey. Head. And then H is also for hair. Hey. Hair. Those are just some of the many things that start with H. I is for ice skate. Can you see ice? Art. Ice. Art. Skate. Skate. The people in the background in this painting are skating on the ice. Can you point to an ice skate? What season do you think it is? What season do you think it is? Do you think it's winter? What good? Okay, winter. J is for jam. Sir. Jam. Can you find the jam in this painting? The jam is inside a jar. Another word that begins with the letter J. What color is the jam? What color is that? Is that red? Red, red. Red. And what color is this jam? Same. What color? Yolk. Is that blue? 
Purple. 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 There you go. Some people spread jam on toast, muffins, or crackers. How do you like to eat jam? Do you have a favorite flavor of jam? I actually don't have a fla favorite flavor of jam. I like all of the flavors. <laughs> Like strawberry, blueberry, blackberry. I like all those kinds of jams. Can you say jam? Say. Jam. K is for? Kite. 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 The boys in this painting are flying kites. How many kites do you see in this painting? Can you count how many triangles are on each kite? Hmm. I see one, two, three. Three, four, five, six triangles on each kite. Three on each side. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. So, wait. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yes, six. <laughs> okay. L is for lake. Can you say lake? Yeah. Lake. How many boys are swimming in the lake? What color is the lake? One. What? Dot. One, two. What color is the lake? What color? Yo. Blue. Good job, Sydney. Is that a rabbit? Rabbit. Rabbit. M is for? Moon. Moon. The moon is bright in the night sky. What does its shape remind you of? What else in this painting begins with the letter M? Hmm, mountain. Can you see mountain? Mountain. Oh, wait, no, is this water? Wait, hold on. No, I think. Oh my gosh, I can't tell if that's water or a mountain or what. I'm just gonna say mountain. I don't know. Oh, and what else? What does its shape remind you of? What else in this painting gets the letter M? Okay. So I think this shape reminds me of, it can remind me of a smile. Can you say smile? Smiles. All you have to do is add two eyes. And it also can remind you of a frown. Can you say frown? Yeah. Frown. And if it's a full moon, if you could see the full circle, it could remind me of the letter O, which we're about to go over next. Oh wait, no, we're gonna go over N first. N is for? Nest. Bet. Nest. Birds lay their eggs in nests, which they build using twigs, leaves, straw, and anything else they could find on the ground. How many eggs are in the nest? One. One. Two. Way. Yeah, there's three. Good job, Sydney. O is for over. The moon is over the mountain. Okay, it is mountain. The moon is over the mountain. The letter O is also for oval. Can you say oval? Oval. Oval. Do you see any ovals in this painting? Yes, I do actually. The eggs are in shape of an oval. And the difference between a circle and an oval is an oval is longer. And the just the regular circle is more stubby. <laughs> okay. P is for? Pillow. 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 Can you find the pillow in this painting? I see a pillow. Hello. Do you have pillows in your bedroom? Yes, we do. How many pillows are in your living room? Actually, we don't really have any pillows in our living room, actually. Q is for? Week. Queen. The queen is kneeling on the pillow. Can you point to the queen's crown? Where's the queen's crown? You wear it on your head. Wee. Right there. Wake. That's the queen. There's the crown. And wag. Crown. R is for? Red. Red. The queen is wearing a long red dress. What other colors can you name in this painting? Do you have a favorite color? Hmm, well, my, my favorite color would be either... Hmm. That's actually a really tough question. I think it always changes, but today my favorite color is red. Can you say red? Red. Red. And I spy another color. I spot a creamy white. Can you say white? What? Yellow. Yo yo. Yellow teal. Yo. Teal. <laughs> okay. S is for sitting. Can you say sitting? Wicked. 
Sitting. This woman is sitting on a bench. Are you sitting right now? Do you have a favorite place in your house where you like to sit? Hmm. Actually, right now Sydney is sitting down, and I am standing up right now. And hmm, our favorite spot to sit down is on a nice rocking chair. T is for weed. Tree. How many trees do you see in this painting? Do you have trees around your house? Actually, uh, yes, we have a little dwarf plum tree. Actually, uh, how many? Oh, how many trees do you see in this painting? I see one, two, three, four. Can you say four? Four. Four. And it looks like there might be another tree far away, all the way back there. U is for umbrella. Can you say umbrella? What, Yank? Umbrella. What color is the woman's umbrella? Uh, it looks like a creamy white. Can you say white? White. Or either that or a very light pink. I'm not sure. Or like a yellowish color. I really don't know, actually. <laughs> Uh, why do you think she has an umbrella with her? Well, it actually doesn't look like it's raining or anything, but you could use it for when it rains to protect yourself from raining, or you could use it to block the sun so you don't get sunburned. V is for violin. Can you say violin? Violin. Violin. Violins are musical instruments with four strings. Can you think of any other musical instruments that have strings? How many violins do you see in this painting? Yes, I can think of a guitar. Can you say guitar? Go. Guitar and the cello. Can you say cello? Cello. Cello. I see one, two, three, four, five violins. And can you think of any other musical instruments to have strings? Yes, the cello and the guitar. Okay, W is for woman. Can you say woman? Woman. Woman. How many women are on this painting? How many women are wearing white dresses? One. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. There's five women in this picture, but there is only four women wearing a white dress. One. One. Two, three, four, five. Oh, only four. Four is wearing the dress. Four. 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 All right, we're almost done. X is for xylophone. Can you say xylophone? Xylophone. Xylophone. This little boy is getting ready to play the xylophone. To make music, he'll tap on the keys of the xylophone with his mallets. How many mallets does he have? One. One. Two. Have you ever played the xylophone? What instruments do you like to play? Yes, me and Sydney actually have played the xylophone before. And my favorite instrument to play is actually my voice. My vocal cords is an instrument itself. I love to sing. <laughs> okay. Why is for yellow? Can you say yellow? Yo yo. Yellow. Wait. Okay, I wanna make sure we read the, through this whole page. I got distracted for a second. Why is for yellow? The artist used lots of yellow paint for this picture. Look around you right now. Do you see anything yellow? Are you wearing anything yellow today? Try to find something yellow in every room of your house. Well, right now, I'm not wearing anything yellow. Sunny isn't wearing anything yellow either, but I do see this yellow marker in the same room. Can you say yellow? Yellow. yellow and do you see anything yellow wait yeah i see a lot of yellow in this painting can you see painting wait, wait. painting okay z is for zebra 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 can you name the two colors on the zebra can you think of another animal that looks a lot like a zebra well i see black can you see black yeah and white. Ooh, white. White. And I think a donkey and a horse looks a lot like a zebra, except different colors. They don't have stripes. This is a very colorful picture of the alphabet. Point to each of the letters and try to name as many as you can. There's only one white letter in the picture. Can you find it? What letter is it? What letter does your name begin with? Can you find it in this picture? Okay, so I see, I think I know what this one is. This is the white letter. What is it? H. Eat. 
is and me and Sydney's me and Sydney's names begin with S. Both of our names. Can you say S? S. S. Sydney and Starlet. Okay, now let's go through the whole alphabet. A, A B, B, C, D, E, e F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, P Q, R, S, S, T, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z. Now I know my A, B, C's. Next time, won't you sing with me? Yay! So that is it for today, everyone. I really hope you all enjoyed it. And we will see you all next time. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Get your favorite page. These are actually different pages because it's like cardboard or, yeah, I guess so. I don't know. Oh, yeah, here's our bird, Shesharina. Say hi to Shesharina. Bye-bye, Shesharina. <laughs> That's a very good page. What's your favorite animal or letter or color? Zebra. Zebra.